It's Subprime Blogger back to help you find bad credit loans. And we're in the state of Florida still. We've recently done Cape, Cape Coral, Florida. And now we're heading over to Port St. Lucie, Florida to look for the payday loan options for bad credit borrowers. If finances are getting tough and the only real option is a payday loan, then here are some of the locations in your area. I go to go to maps.google.com and just type in your city and payday loans and Google Maps does a great job of showing you retailers or banks or lending companies that are available in a specific area. And as you can see there are five major payday loan companies in Port St. Lucie and they are the very common names Check and Go, Advance America, there are actually three Advance America locations which are not even you know a couple miles from each other but this is very common with um, payday loans. Most of these websites, in fact all of these I'm sorry, all of these companies have websites that you can apply online. If you simply click on the website under the name in Google Maps, it will take you to the, it will pop up in a new window and it will take you to the website. And almost every single one of these larger payday loan companies, such as Check and Go, allow you to apply online for up to $1,500. It's usually the case that you can have this money in your bank account by the next day if you're doing this online process but remember you're gonna pay very steep fees for any type of payday loan as you can see check and go has a huge expansion into even if you don't live in Port St. Lucie Florida if you live in other parts of Florida and Alabama or you're going to that area there are payday loan locations I'm going to go ahead and close that one. Another one is Advance America. This is a huge company throughout the United States as well. And you're going to have an opportunity to put your zip code in and find a location. They will also allow you to apply online. I am certain most of these companies are going to do the online process just because so many people don't want to go to a store. And they offer more than just payday loan. Here you go. You can apply for a loan or find a location near you. You'd have to put in your zip code. So that's basically the process that would work. Before going through any of the payday loan process, I would go to the CFSAA website. If you search CFSAA payday, you'll see the first result is CFSAA.com. And you can click there. And this is a website that basically tells you everything you need to know about payday loans. Um, it doesn't necessarily say anything good or bad about them. It points out that they are fair. You know, that can be argued. That's not what I'm here to do. I'm here to tell you what resources are available. If you go to our resources and you go to customer resources, there's going to be a tab for know your fee as you scroll down. There's a lot of tabs, but go to know your fee and you're going to see that each state that offers payday loans has a maximum amount fee that is set by the government that can be charged. And there are many states that can't offer payday loans that the government has stopped allowing. But in the state of Florida, the maximum fee is $15 for everyone. That is 10 times the worst credit card annual percentage rate. So if you are thinking about a payday loan you may want to consider other options like an installment loan or a personal loan or even a terrible credit credit card this maximum amount of fifteen dollars that's pretty common across a lot of states so basically if you borrow a thousand dollars that means every time you borrow a thousand dollars it's one thousand one hundred and fifty dollars and the bad thing about this is if you can't pay that money back with your next paycheck those fees reset. So if you get a paycheck next week and you don't pay it, you still owe the $1,150, but another $150 is tacked on. So then you're going to owe $1,300, and it's just going to keep adding up over time, and this is how people can get into a very bad situation. But if you know you're Lucy, a lot of them are on this same same highway here, which is the federal, hi federal highway just east of I-95 heading down from from Daytona to Miami. Um, 
you can definitely search online and find other options. This, these are just the most common names that are produced on Google Maps. I would also consider looking for banks in the area that offer installment loans and I've recently done a YouTube video that explains how to find banks that offer installment loans. So you might want to check out that one. But if you've gotten a payday loan in Florida or you're thinking about it, please make sure to comment and if you like this video, please like it on YouTube.